got that juice. juice. No AP. She got that juice. I got your juicy entertainment news for Wednesday. Eminem's ex wife, Kim Scott, was reportedly hospitalized at the end of last month following a suicide attempt. Apparently, police and emergency workers responded to a call of a suicidal person at her home, and、uh, that happened on July 30th. And she was so combative that when they arrived, that they had to restrain her before they could hospitalize her. She reportedly cut herself and had multiple small lacerations on the back of her leg.、Um, she was taken to the hospital for medical. And psychological evaluation and has since returned home, but there's no word on、uh, what's happening with her now. Now, this is not her first suicide attempt. In an interview with People, she revealed that she had attempted suicide after she heard Eminem's fans embracing a diss song that he did about her back in the day. And、uh, in 2015, she also attempted suicide again. Kim is the biological mother of Eminem's daughter, Haley, as well as his adopted daughter, Whitney. Um, she was married to Eminem for two years, beginning in 1999, and、uh, after getting divorced, they remarried for a brief time again in 2006. Now, while we await the release of Donda, Kanye is being accused of stealing Donda's merch design. An up and coming designer has publicly accused Kanye of stealing his work and using it for his Donda apparel. He reportedly met and spoke with Kanye prior to the Donda listening events at the Mercedes Benz Stadium and even sent Kanye several design samples.、Um, now, this just happened recently. On his design page, Infinity GADS, his company shared their side of the story.、Um, they did a TikTok video saying that they had recorded a call with Kanye where he was inviting them to Atlanta to meet with him. Kanye loved the items, he loved the materials, he loved the design. The call was labeled with the date July 4th, 2021. So that was just a few weeks ago. Now, the team reportedly drove nine hours to Atlanta. They signed the NDAs. They Showed videos of themselves inside the stadium waiting to sit down with Kanye for the meeting.、Um, and then they showed that the Infinity G8DS design is a six pointed star resembling the Star of David with an infinity symbol wrapped around the cross in the middle. Well, Kanye's used pretty much the exact same design, except for in the center, he took out the infinity symbol and left the cross. Now, Kanye's team has not responded to these accusations, but as you can imagine, people have rallied around the brand in support on social media, and、uh, they have been lighting it up like fire over the last day. Speaking of lighting things up, the countdown is on for Aaliyah's One in a Million re release. It will hit streaming services on August 20th. Her uncle Barry Hankerson, whose label Black Ground Records 2.0 revealed a few days ago that、uh, they will be releasing iconic albums from Aaliyah, Timbaland and Magoo, JoJo, and Tank. They will all finally be hitting streaming services after more than a decade. And you know, Aaliyah's music has been practically non existent on, on streaming platforms. So the news of her classic albums coming to streaming services, this is a really big deal. Um, and a typical countdown, it's different. They're going to be doing it completely different. They've decided to re release the album by switching things up and counting to the seconds leading up to the album's release. And、uh, the seconds will eventually hit one million in honor of the re release of One in a Million. And that's your juicy entertainment news for Wednesday. Locking in again tomorrow for more of the juice right here on the all new Kiss 96.